Hey, Bonnie. You were telling me about your friend who is having some difficulties making the right financial decisions for himself and his business. How did the conversation go? Were you guys able to settle things? Rose, I don't understand. Seriously, what kind of question is that? How can someone make good financial decisions in this Nigerian economic mess? Let alone run a business. I, I don't get it. Are you trying to tell me that you guys didn't actually breach any agreement? See, I understand the stuff, but we can't give up now. There are still opportunities if we look for them. Opportunities? Rose, have you seen the inflation rates recently? It's soaring high, 22.79%, and the Naira keeps losing value. Most small-scale entrepreneurs are losing their minds daily. See, we have to be creative, Bonnie. There's a way to go about this. Cut the necessary costs, save what we can, and look for investments with stable returns. Eh? What did you just say? Yes, I said stable, stable returns. returns. Yes. Rose, tell me where to find those in this roller coaster economy. Just tell me. See, eh? This thing is not impossible, Oboni. We have a resilient spirit as Nigerians. We can find ways to grow financially even in challenging times. <laughs> resilient spirit indeed. Which resilient spirit wants to pay the bills, Rose? The cost of living is through the roof. Even those on salaries can barely cover their basic needs, not to talk of entrepreneurs. I know it's tough, Bonnie. But we have to cut unnecessary excesses and be smart about our spending. Eh? <laughs> oh god, I, I am really surprised at the kind of things that are coming out of your mouth. Did I just say you say smart spending? When the prices of goods are changing daily? Come on Rose now, this is just a guessing game. It's not a guessing game, Bonnie. I know it's challenging, but we have to adapt. Look for stable investments or start smaller businesses. Smaller businesses? <laughs> with, with the taxes and regulation that we have to deal with? See, Bonnie, we can research and do proper planning, you know. We'll find sectors with growth potential, then we can invest. <laughs> oh, Rose, you are you are you in fact you're supposed to be a comedian. I don't understand. Is what it because you, what, of what this? do you mean by growth potential? Yes. With this government that keeps changing policies and corruption is rampant. See, I won't deny the challenge is bunny, but we can't let that stop us now. We can advocate for change and support ethical businesses. Advocacy would not fill our pockets, Rose. Advocacy won't fill our pockets. We need tangible solutions, not these dreams that you are offering. Dreams, dreams, dreams. Dreams feel determination. They do, Bunny. We can work and improve our skills to be more employable. Eh? Employable? In this economy? Yes. Rose, do you know how scarce jobs are? Do you know how people are losing their jobs left, right and center? Even entrepreneurs can't even keep up with running the day-to-day -day activities of their business. Everyone's finances are just unmanageable. I understand, Bonnie, but we have to be cautious and consider alternatives like microfinance. Those ones that have their own interest rates that are just as bad as what I, I don't I don't just get it. Everybody can't be bad. We have to compare and choose the lesser evil bunny. We can't let the obstacles define our future. Anyways, people, that is it for today. It will come your way again in the next episode. Remember that the financial decisions you make today have a far-reaching effect on how the rest of your life turns out. At Rosabond Financial Services, we work with you to achieve financial freedom. Our array of financial products and services are created to help you plan a financially rewarding and stress-free future, even as you live the lifestyle you desire. Do you want expert advice on the best financial plan for you? Kindly reach out to us on our website and www.rosabondfinance.com. You can also call 0700 Rosabond. 0700 to speak with a customer service agent today.